Good morning. Take two, because I got interrupted by teenagers. So today is the 26th of December, Saturday, day after Chrissy Mouse in the States. So I'm in the Carolinas and uh, it's been bitter cold. And I can certainly see where when you're awakened and aware, and then you're around others who are not, it can be very difficult to keep your spiritual stuff in movement. So yesterday I went for a nice long walk with my daughter and the dog. So I really didn't get to connect very well. So later when everybody was in the shower, I decided I was gonna go out for another walk. And when I did that, it was really cold. When I came back, I forgot the key code number to get in the house. And I'm knocking on the doors and no one's letting me in. So I just looked up at my spirit and I'm just like, all right guys, let's just sit here and see what you gotta show me. And of course, you know, the faces come and the, the spheres come and they shoot off all these orbs and they just show me a lot of amazing things. And then the day went on and next thing you know, you're going to bed and it's, you're meditating and listening to something on YouTube and here we are the day after. So this morning I got up early, I went to the park and as I was walking, I really noticed there was weird plane activity. Like they were in formation. It was just, I've never seen it here before. And it was just like one after the other and in different formations and all ascending, which I just thought was bizarre, it just caught my eye. So anyway, as I, was, as I was walking, my fingertips were so frozen. I mean, I, it was so painful that I had to go back to my car. I turned the heat on and just sit there, which is what I did. And so then I called in the highest star beings, and my higher beings to be with me that are here in divine service of love of the God goddess. And they do not disappoint. I might get frustrated with them because I want more, um, but they do not disappoint. I mean, you see the spheres and the orbs and the all kinds of stuff, fun stuff. And they're moving their mouths like they're talking to me and I keep saying, hey, I'm gonna need you to speak on the vibration, the bandwidth that I am here as a human. So then they said to me, well, you're trying to figure us out visually and mentally, just close your eyes and feel with your heart and see if you can hear us with your heart. So I started to do that for a little bit and then time was up. I needed to get back to the house because everybody wanted to go to brunch. So here I is. I hope each and every one of you are doing your very best to hang in there and to uh, just do your best to maintain your spiritual energy because it is coming in and it's beautiful. It is so exciting. There's so much more activity than I've seen in a while. And if I sit there for just a minute or two and call them in, they're all over. And then at night, I will open the blind up and like stick my eye out the blind like this and I'm looking and choo, one will just appear and it'll do little flashies for me and let me know. And it's like, it's like having a soul sister or soul brother family out there. And I just feel like I just get a, this giant hug and I love it. All right, so many blessings to you the day after Chrissy Mus and hang in there and stay in your heart and be in nature as much as you possibly can, which means you've got to That'll put you in the right space. All right, till the next video.